Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you a very cool formula for the number of ways to represent a natural number as a sum of four squares of integers. Uh, before I do it, I'm just going to show you, I got it from this book, it's really cool, I recommend it. It's about it's also all about elliptic curves and has a lot of interesting stuff. Anyway, so the idea is we're going to define S4 of n to be the number of ways for some natural number n to write it as a sum of four different squares of integers. It could be negative, could be zero, could be positive. Um, and we do care about the order. So, um, like, if we had this, like, this would be counted separately from um, this. Like, like th th these would count differently because the order does matter. Um, and then also, like, this could be, like, negative 3 squared. Anyway, so the formula, which I just found, it's amazing how simple it is. You just take 8 times... Sum over all the divisors of n that are not multiples of 4. And, that, and that, that's it. Um, so, for example, if we wanted to do 5, we could just do, what are the divisors of 5? 1 and 5. Neither are multiples of 4. So, we, we just take our 8 and multiply by 1 plus 5, 48. And we could also do a different number like 8, for example. If we wanted to take S4 of 8, what we could do is, well, what are the divisors of 8? 1, 2, 4, and 8. But remember, we do not count divisors that are multiples of 4. So it's just 1, 2. So our formula is just, remember, we take 8, and then we take these two divisors and add them up. And it's just 8 times 1 plus 2, which is 24. And so I just found it really impressive how there was just such a simple formula for this. And I hope you guys uh, found this as cool as I did. Thanks for watching. Bye.